while. Oh, good. How you <laughs> found it and challenges with it. Mm -hmm. And um, I wondered if you'd like to show us. I would love to. I would love to. And thank you for inviting me to do that. I brought along my trusty guitar. <laughs> um, and I'd just love to play a song that um, I've done well over a hundred of these songs now, so it's a little tricky to pick which one, but I chose this one because it is the most hot off the press. This song was just completed, and uh, it's a song that a husband commissioned for his wife. And I thought it was a really good fit for the theme of your show because the assignment from him for me was to really get a handle on what's incredible about my wife, what makes her amazing and strong and capable, and how could we celebrate that? So this song is called Dive In, and I'd love to share it with you now. Covered in grit, knee deep in stuff no one else would touch, that was my first view. Something in me changed when I felt you to watch you dive in fearless, wide open, ready, steady, strong. I see all of me turning. to your music. <laughs> you know I've heard it many times and yeah. every time it's like the universe is sort of sparkling around you. Oh, well, thank you. So true. So um, Anna, how did you, um, first of all, how does it feel when you're playing? Do you have a, a feeling about it? Um, it feels, when I'm playing it feels the same way as when a song is getting born when I'm composing it, which is um, very open, like there's a lot of breathing room, 
um, and a lot of uh, very positive energy. It's a very joyful kind of a feeling. Mm. Even when it's, that was a kind of an upbeat song, but even when it's, you know, a very poignant, like, this is difficult, my mother died, I didn't get to say what I need, there's still a feeling inside of me that's very spacious. Like, okay, when you hit the heart of something, there's a lot of room to breathe. Mm, that's great. I imagine people who are watching are thinking, well, that's her gift. How would I know if I had mine? Yeah. So could you tell us a little bit about how you found this gift that you had? Yeah. Um, I think the turning point for me, I, I come from a musical family, so we always used to sing in the car on road trips and stuff like that. But um, for me, one of the things that opened it out was falling in love. That when I met the man who is now my husband, um, something in me, a sort of a song kind of woke up inside of me. And I think that that's often true that when we're in a situation, it doesn't have to be falling in love, but when we're in a situation where we discover a part of ourself waking up in the presence of something. It could be a hobby that you really love or maybe a new baby that's born. It doesn't have to be, you know, member of the opposite sex. But I think um, for a lot of us, and certainly for me, when you find yourself in a new place where you get to see yourself anew, a good version of yourself, that's a really ripe time for gifts to come forward. Hmm. And was there an event when you met your husband that like it was a particular day that you noticed or something that happened that day? I just, uh, I remember really vividly this one day, he used to uh, be in construction and he was, I had just gone to visit him in the middle of this cornfield where he was building a barn. And so I was driving through this cornfield and this song just popped into me. And it was really fun. It was like, nobody was listening. So I just had the windows open and I was singing it as loud as you could sing. And it was just sort of like three lines of a song. And then the more I sang them, it sort of was like, oh, maybe there's a fourth line in there. And it was the first time I'd ever composed a song. It was just sort of like, you know, it welled up inside of me and it was ready to come out. And it was just a really incredible feeling. Like, whoa, what is this? Okay, well, I'll get out of the way and let it come forward. So it sounds like it was really effortless. Yeah. Yeah. in many ways. So yeah. finding our gifts and talents is, I think, effortless. I think that's one of the clues on the road is if it's if you're sort of like something's popping forward or suddenly it's like, oh, I don't know what this is, but it feels okay. I think I'll just lean into it. I think that's a good sign that you're on the path to yeah. getting a new, new gift born. Well, I think being a 